Hey guys, I'm Michael Allen for TravelCostaRicaNow.com. TravelCostaRicaNow.com is a travel agency, so go to TravelCostaRicaNow.com. Fill out the four-minute form. You'll be that much closer to the vacation of a lifetime. But only if you want to jump through all the hoops they have nowadays. We're going to be discussing that in a minute. I'd appreciate a subscribe. Uh, thank you in advance. Um, so it's Wednesday, January 13th, and the hits just keep coming. So it came out, uh, when was it? Yesterday, day before, the United States is going to demand people that travel outside the United States and are going to, going to come back. Traveling abroad, you've got to return to the United States. You're going to have to have a COVID test within 72 hours of boarding the plane. I believe it's 72 hours. So they're following in the footsteps of Canada. But Canada wants a quarantine when you get back as well. I don't, I don't think the United States, people in the United States would put up with that. So there's no quarantine. You just got to have the COVID test before you board the plane on your way back to the United States. Now, for all of you, I'm sure you know this, the United States is our number one supporter. Those are the most tourists come to Costa Rica from the United States. So this is just another hit for us because, you know, it gets to a point where people go, man, I'm not jumping through all those hoops. That's what it comes down to. Now, Costa Rica is not stupid. They realize that they're going to have to make these tests uh, kind of easy to get, you know. So, I mean, if they're smart, they'll actually have in some of the hot spots instead of just the San Jose area, which there already are plenty of places to get the, the COVID test, the, the, the correct one. They kind of need them to where, like, like, let's say Man Juan Antonio, Tamarindo area, some of these places so you don't really have to go back into like a a San Jose area to do it. But they're going to work all that out because, again, they're not stupid. They're, they're going to cater. They're going to try to make it as easy as possible. I believe that test is going to be between uh, around $80 to $100 per person. <sighs> you know, it's hard not to talk or sound political when you talk about this, but this clusterfuck, this clusterfuck that they call the COVID pandemic I just know one thing. I don't, actually, I know a lot of things, I think, but I know one thing. I guarantee you, mark this video, I guarantee you the economic consequences of this COVID pandemic will be much worse than Aunt Martha dying. It will. Um, when's this, when, if, if you kept going with this, let's say there's a third strain, a 17th wave, a uh, more log. How, how long does this go for? How long does this go for? We realize we need to get the world spinning again. You know, 98% or so people that get COVID don't have an issue with it. That's pretty good odds, just so we're clear. But the thing is, eventually, the it is going to come to be true that the economy economy impact will be more important. So, why don't we move that along now? What are we waiting for? Complete devastation, complete devastation of the economy. Uh, that's not to mention uh, suicides, child abuse, spousal abuse, losing businesses and stuff. Really, really, we're just gonna keep doing this. Uh, another strain, another strain. Lockdown, masks, because at some point the economy will win. Right? Can we can we agree on that math? All right. I don't know. Uh, the other thing for Costa Rica is <laughs> this is just too funny. First, they come out and say we're closing the beaches at two thirty. They've changed that. I think there was this big meeting, big meeting, and they said let's make it six o'clock. <laughs> So, it changes to 6 o'clock. Now, guys, if you haven't been to Costa Rica, you're looking for the entry requirements and you want to know what to do, all of that will be in the description. Everything. Links, things you need to know about entering Costa Rica right now. And I'll even put some of the places you can get that uh, COVID test, um, too, as well. So, Man, I don't know. You know what? I do have a video. I, I think I'm going to put it out on Sunday morning. I actually have the answer for Costa Rica. I really do. This is not a joke. Be looking forward on Sunday morning. I have the answer to Costa Rica's uh, 
money issues, we'll say. Sunday morning, guarantee it, and they can thank me later. Anyway, guys, I'm Michael Allen, TravelCoastRicaNow.com. Peace, guys. How many hoops do you want to jump through?